kind of a shame the amount of damage that somebody will do to get uh, bikes that seem very valuable. A South Jordan bike shop picking up the pieces now after a thief drove through the storefront and loaded up with multiple very expensive electric mountain bikes. Incredible video we're seeing right here. The owner asked for people to be on alert for these bikes as they are not cheap. And the manager thinks that is part of the draw. The thief knew exactly what he was looking for. As new specialist Jed Bull shows us, after the thief drove a truck through the sliding doors, he was gone in two minutes. This is where the thief plowed into Hangar 15 bicycles at 3.15 Saturday morning. The operations manager estimates $50,000 worth of damage to the building and another $50,000 in stolen bicycles. He just drove it clean through the front of the building through two of our glass sliding doors. Crashing into the Hangar 15 showroom in a black Ford pickup F-250 or F-350. And it actually looked like, surprisingly enough, he had a dog in the car with him. Working quickly. But it was one guy just chucking e-bikes into the back of the truck. And, you know, these aren't exactly light, and he was just hurling them in the back of that pickup truck. So I'm sure they were pretty damaged. He stole five electric mountain bikes, specialized Levos, just like these. It rides a lot like a regular bicycle. It's really intuitive to ride. Uh, it's gonna be very smooth, and so that's why that's a really popular sought after bike. Ranging from $6,000 to $15,000. Like he probably knew what he was after. In and out of the shop in two minutes. The guy on his way out ran over a bunch of bikes. There's glass and stuff everywhere. Around 10 bikes badly damaged. And he ran over half of these. The shop manager thinks it was probably a stolen truck, and the police say that is likely. And there's a, there's a Levo that didn't quite make it. Bikes are only getting more expensive. Unfortunately, they're fairly easy to physically steal, so I think that's why people are attracted to them. Call the South Jordan police if you know something about this break-in or recognize something about that thief. For KSL 5 News, I'm Jed Bowl.